I have to tell you that every time it snows, I think about the hazard of the snow and for good reason. After a moderate snowfall years ago, my dad went out to sweep the snow off of the sidewalk. He was 61 years old and that exertion led to a heart attack that he did not survive. He had no prior history of heart problems. So with that, I offer this word of caution to you, and it doesn't matter whether you're male or female. As cardiologist Dr. Amish Mehta from Allegheny Health Network says, snow can be dangerous. Shoveling snow is something we all take for granted, and it's kind of the part of the winter weather, but what a lot of people don't realize is that uh, there's a fair amount of exertion that can go into shoveling snow, and uh, that puts a lot of stress on the heart in somewhat of a sudden fashion. Are victims of this, generally speaking, who have a sedentary lifestyle, pre-existing conditions? And yes to both of those. So uh, most people will have some form of heart disease that could be just something simple from high blood pressure or high cholesterol to something more involved, such as having had a heart attack, having stents. A fair amount of uh, individuals are sedentary, especially with the COVID-19 uh, pandemic that we're dealing with and people quarantining or staying at home, this may be the first time many individuals have exerted themselves in weeks or months. And so the sudden new exertion on the body can cause a heart attack. What is a sign that you would be feeling that should be a red flag? Uh, when individuals are either during or after the shoveling, they may uh, experience chest discomfort. And that could be anything from chest pressure, tightness, uh, squeezing, and aching pain in the chest. They may experience sudden shortness of breath. Yeah, and Dr. Betta says some shortness of breath. Well, that's pretty normal when you're shoveling. But if it persists, even after you stop, that's a point of concern. And the older you are, the more you have to be careful. And please don't ignore the warning signs.